So that would be quite fantastic. Oh, and uh, also, what, 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 what happens if you need a vehicle that uh, is bigger than a Model Y? The, the Robovan. The Robovan is, uh, this is a, we're, we're going to make this, and it's going to look like that. Now, can you imagine going down the streets and you see this coming towards you? That'd be sick. So this can, this can carry up to 20 people, and it can also uh, transport goods. So you can configure it for goods transport within a city, uh, or transport of up to 20 people at a time. So this is going <laughs> to, the Robovan is what's going to solve for high density. So if you, if you want to take a sports team somewhere, or um, you're looking to, to really get uh, the cost of travel down to, I don't know, five, 10 cents a mile, then you can use the Robovan. Some people call it the Robovan, but. Uh... <laughs> so yeah. Uh, you know, one of the things that we, we want to do, and you've seen this with the Cybertruck, is we want to change the, the look of the roads. You know, the future should look like the future. Something we're also doing is, uh, and it's really high time we did this, is uh, inductive charging. So the rubber taxi has no plug. It, it just uh, goes over the inductive charger and charges. So, yeah, it's kind of how it should be. Whereas the, the cost of uh, CyberCab, uh, we, th we think probably over time, from the operating cost is probably going to be around 20 cents a mile. Um, and price, including taxes and, and everything else, probably ends up being 30 or 40 cents a mile. We expect the cost to be below $30,000. Yeah. We, we do expect, actually, to, st to start a fully autonomous, uh, unsupervised FSD uh, in Texas and California next year. And that, that's obviously, that's with the Model 3 and Model Y. And then we, we, we expect to be in production with the, the CyberCab, which is really um, hi highly optimized for autonomous transport uh, in probably, well, I tend to be a little optimistic with time frames. Um, but but in, tw in, in 2026. So yeah, before 2027, let me put it that way. <laughs> now, we, we are going to actually overspec the computer for the CyberCab. Uh, so our, our AI5 computer um, will be somewhat overspec. So you can have your own personal R2D2 C3PO. And I think at scale, the, the you know this would cost something like, I don't know, twenty, thirty thousand dollars.